Welcome to our van life with our three chihuahuas, episode 92, here in the Oregon coast at Winchester Bay RV Campground, on our way down back to California. We stop for more beach views and we thank you all for joining in. It's a crisp. 36 degrees this morning and this RV park was uh OHV park was partying it up late those guys over there were playing like 80s like love songs until like probably like three in the morning but you can hear the dunes are over there you can hear them Everybody's already out in the cold. Chewbacca is ready to get cleaned up. So we parked. Our reservation was right next to this beach access. And this is where the ATVs bomb in and out from the beach. We'll uh, try to walk down there while it's low population here before we head out. Okay, Pia, what are we doing now? Going to the dunes. That way. Let's go. It's a little lake. I think it's this way. We have frosty sand. It got below freezing last night, so this should be interesting beach scene. We had to uh, traverse some ATV trails to get it, but I think we have hit the beach here. I see ocean. So this is smack dab in the middle of the Oregon Coast Dunes. We are in Winchester Bay, just north is Florence, and that's when the real huge ones, whoa, these waves are big. We did see there was a notice for a wave advisory this weekend. Wow, it's like surfing crazy. out here yet.
What do you think of the dunes in the freezing cold weather? Yeah. Okay, we put their thermal dresses on and it didn't keep them warm enough and it's 38 degrees right now with a little breeze. So we're gonna head back to the van where the heat is on. But nice little bay here. Back to the campsite. Let's go. What's up everybody so we got a little adventure exploration when we left the dunes up north and we found our way to sunset bay which is in charleston which is right by coos bay and it's like a beautiful area we got some guys surfing over there Got some uh, decent rollers coming in. It's almost like a Hawaii style inlet. And uh, we're gonna have brunch here. So we're gonna get going, get cooking, and then uh, get back heading down south. So we're doing brunch uh, Saturday morning with a view. having bacon chihuahuas are a bit stimulated by the sound of the ocean some really big ocean waves out there by the rocks there were bigger waves crashing into those rocks right there but kind of calm down a little bit there's still some big waves beautiful views out here so we're at a good spot to make breakfast avocado toast Sean's just getting everything ready and there's people surfing out here too Okay, Pia, this is our brunch spot. What do you think? They're big out there. Big waves. Yeah. 
Hey, Chabal. So this is the product of not knowing or having a direct agenda. What do you think about how this went? Yeah. Baba, you have some food? We got the doggies uh, comfortable and we're gonna head out of Oregon coast. This is our goodbye brunch. A lot of people out here enjoying the views on a holiday weekend. A lot of doggos. Some people still trying to surf. So we're saying goodbye from the Oregon coast. We found a spot in, I think it's the product of not having a plan sometimes. Uh, this is Sunset Bay in uh, Charleston near Coos Bay. <laughs> and uh, we had a really nice brunch, hung out here. Uh, what do you think, Pia? Was this a good end to our exploration of the Oregon coast? Yes, this just happened to be by luck that we found this place. So we're super sad to leave Oregon and go back to work. But this was quite an adventure and we're definitely coming back. Sunday, day four of our Thanksgiving trip. We made it back to California last night. Got in about uh, 7.30, 8 o'clock. And uh, we ended up stopping at the uh, Rolling Hills Casino, which is over there. And they have an RV park that's nice and spacious. And we have plenty of room. We stayed in the back corner. A couple of people rolled in. Looks like late last night, but it was quiet. Everything is fenced and secure back here. And we got hookups, so we, we needed to fill up water. We took showers in the van. And we're going to be ready to head home. Have a little... Sunday routine. So, I can definitely recommend. This was easy, it was about like 50 bucks um, for the evening. Bale's still not used to this uh, kind of cold weather. Last yesterday in the morning, we went to the dunes and it was about like 32 degrees but really wet and cold on our feet. And now it's about, uh, well, actually we stopped over um, Shasta Peak and it was like 28 uh, degrees there and went to go use the bath bathroom and she was shaking. And now she's doing the same thing. She's all shivering um, because it's about 35, 36. She doesn't quite have the uh, meat on her bones yet to be able to withstand the winter and uh, thicker fur, but she's getting there. She's getting big already, and uh, we have a big vet appointment this week, so she's gonna be coming more of an adult dog a week by week, and they grow up so fast. Huh? Billy Boo.